Hey, you're up. Yeah, I couldn't sleep. Ten more minutes. Mm. I have so much to do today. All right. Guess I'll get going then. See ya. Hey, I was hoping to see you around. Yeah, hey. What's up? Got another piece of your meal today. Oh, yeah, more bills. Great, thanks. Yeah. Listen, I was wondering if you maybe wanted to grab drinks or dinner today? Um, yeah, yeah, no, um, yeah, I would. Um, I already made plans for tonight, though. But we should at some point. Yeah, cool, because I'm, you know, I'm just right down the hall if you ever need anything. Cool. Thanks, Tim. Jane, I've had a lot of fun the last few weeks. Yeah, me too. No, I had a lot of fun too. I just, I don't want to make this into a thing. Right. But what if I wanted to? Can we just leave things the way they were before? You're going to find an amazing girl who's crazy about you. I promise. Next time, just slip my mail under the door.
Miss you, all right? You know, you look like you need some assistance. So maybe we can help you. Um, no, actually, I uh, just came out here for some fresh air. I'm trying to get away from the city. Jane, right? Um. Bryce, we met at the bar in Hollywood. My friend's band was playing Chaos Within. Yeah, yeah, right. Um, I know the bass player. Um, my memory sucks. What are you doing up here all alone? Oh, it's all good, brother. She was just catching some fresh air. You staying out here long? No, my friend. Uh, my friends dropped me off. They're coming back up to get me. But I'll probably just stay out here for a bit longer and watch the sunset. Oh, well, that's cool. Well, me and my friends are going to build a fire, knock back a few before we call it a night. We're heading up north in the morning. You're more than welcome to join. Please. I mean, look, it's getting kind of cold out here. OK. Yeah, okay. Let's go. You coming? Sure. What do you say your name was again? Jane. So what's your story? Moved out here from upstate New York a couple years ago, trying to find something. I lied about my friends coming back to get me. Hell, I'll let it slide. I lied too. I'm taking you don't remember, but uh, we had quite a night. You know, I kind of thought something more may have happened. I had a lot to drink that night. <laughs> I didn't come out here for fresh air. Came out here because I'm just done with the struggle. Trust me, I, I tried being sober, facing my demons, all that shit. It only took me a few years moving around city to city to realize I had this dark cloud over me. Shit, man. <laughs> Girl. You need to smoke more. Life sucks. Trust me. But there's got to be something good worth living for. There's no changing my mind. I already addressed the note to my dad. I didn't send it out yet, but it's still in my bag. What's his deal? He made a bunch of money selling luxury cars that he knew didn't work right. Conned all these people and then left town with their money. My cousin gave me his new address. You know, all my life, I was the one who was treated like the bad kid for all the shit I did. Drugs, stealing. He's the one who fucking made me that way. Ain't that a bitch. Keep all the money for himself? Of course. I don't want it anyway. Shit. How much? My cousin said like a hundred grand. No, he probably blew half of it on drugs already. Man. It's crazy how much you can hate yourself when that's all you know. I wish you could see how special you are. Hell, I saw it that night. I can tell you actually see the world around you for what it is. It's beautiful. Tell you what. I'll mail that letter for you. with it.
and I hope you don't. I'll make sure he gets it. Really? Wow. Okay. Yeah, that'd be really cool. May as well get one less fuck you in on my dad after I'm gone. Hell yeah. It really sucks that I had to go down this way. But you walked into our lives at the perfect time. See, we're pretty desperate right now. We owe some people a lot of money. And when you started bragging about your dad and all his fucking cash, well, it got me thinking that us meeting. <laughs> Hell, that wasn't such a coincidence after all. Maybe your dad has some guilt that he has to make up for. We both know what you did to me was and never will be okay. This is my favorite part. You robbed me of my childhood and now my life. Now what did daddy do? I mean, I figure that you wanted to kill yourself anyway. Those are your words, not mine. So why not take advantage of it? Why not, why not blackmail your dad or something? Shoot. Oh, here we go. Sleep well. No mom died not knowing your dirty secrets. But when she died, so did my need to give a shit. Precious. Oh! 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 Give me the locket. Bryce? Bryce, do it! Give me the fucking locket! Bryce! Oh, <gasps> oh, <gasps>